So I don't know if you guys have ever seen my Indian ring neck. I have three of them. Um, two are hand fed since they were about nine weeks old. This is a white headed blue pallid um, Indian ring neck. It's kind of a lace wing coloring as well. So it's possibly called a white headed blue pallid lace wing Indian ring neck. So his head's pure white, which is kind of hard to tell in this video. His body's a powder blue, and he's making a mess. And he's got like this beigey colored ring neck. He talks a little bit. He's hand fed, hand tame, hand raised. And oh my goodness. He knows how to open up his own cage and get out, so I have to put locks on it. And so that's how he's out today. And um, I have a Cremino. And I also have a blue split to um, albino, which means she carries the albino gene. She's paired up with the Cremino, so her Eno, which is albino in her blood, and Cremino will create possibly an albino or Latino baby, I'm not sure. Even though he's creamy color yellow and she's a blue. This little guy here is very cute. These are the most expensive ones. Um, a uh, blue Indian ring neck could be around 300 a Latino's around 300 a Cremino's probably about 250 300 These guys are about $1,400. Uh, it just depends. I kind of got a great deal on him. I got him as a baby. Um, I got two of the babies for 150 him and his Cremino brother. Good change in the screen. You're so cute. Go eat. Eat. Get your pellet and your greens in there. Eat it. And he has full flight, so he can fly around the house. Okay, I just wanted to show you my Indian ring neck. This is just one of them. The other one's paired up with the female, so he's not very nice right now. Thanks for watching. He wants me to hold him. You're so cute with your little foot. Ooh!